For by the grace given to me, I tell everyone among you not to think of himself more highly than he should think. So he says, don't be arrogant. Instead, think sensibly, as God has distributed a measure of faith to each one. So here's the problem, is oftentimes we line up on one side or the other. We're either on the arrogant side, or we're on the self-deprecating side. We're on the side that says, God is lucky to have me, or the side that says, God doesn't need me. He says, don't be arrogant, but he doesn't say, God doesn't need you. He says, don't be arrogant, but think sensibly, because God has distributed a measure of His Spirit to you, and with that Spirit comes giftedness. So here's what you should hear. You are not everything, but you are something. Right? You are not everything, but you are something. If you walk into a church and think that this church is lucky to have me, if you walk into a ministry and you think, they are lucky I'm here. Man, we are blessed you're here. I'm glad about that. I don't want you to hear me say I'm not happy you're here. What I'm saying is that ministry should go on without you, but that ministry should be stronger with you. You are not everything, but you are something. And you are something because not only did the Creator of the universe create you, if you know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, He gave you His Spirit, a portion of His gifting. He gave you something. God gave you something not to just sit there and say, this church doesn't need me. Am I even needed? Now that doesn't mean people will always recognize they need you. But God's right. If the whole crowd of people say they don't need you, the whole crowd of people is wrong. Because God says He has given you something for the common good of His people. God says that. If I walk into a room and say, it doesn't matter that I'm here, I'm wrong. If I walk into a room and say, it really matters that I'm here. In fact, this room wouldn't be the same without me. I'm wrong again. Do not be arrogant, but don't be self-deprecating. Don't think that the, the whole church will crumble without you, but don't forget that the church will be less if you don't use the gifting that God gave you because you're not everything, but you are something to the body of Christ.